What's up everybody, it's Jay Wilkins 79 back here. I am doing Serpico now with Al Pacino, the great Al Pacino. One of the greatest actors of our, of the all time, all time. So in this movie he plays a cop and he, I don't know if he gets promoted or he, but they make him an undercover cop. They call him a, Oh, what's, what do they call him? Well, he's going to wear a plain clothes cop. That's what I'm trying to say. So he's kind of, you know, he uh, he looks, he's still a cop, but he's he's not dressed in the part of a cop, a cop's uniform. So the movie's basically about, Serpico is a really, he's a really honest, down-to-earth cop. He doesn't take bribes from people. Most of the other cops he's working with are really corrupt. And they're taking all sorts of money, and he just is not having that. And he's trying to expose them all. And I really enjoyed the movie. Also, my favorite TV show, It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia, with Charlie Day, who actually did an impression of Al Pacino Serpico, which was really funny. And you can check out that episode. I think it was called Making a Mess of Our Streets or something, where... Uh, so that's how I got into I've always wanted to see Serpico, but Charlie Day's impression of Al Pacino in, in that It's Always Sunny show made me even want to see the movie more, and I finally got to see it. I'm going to give it three and a half out of five. I was a little bit disappointed that some of Charlie's Day, Charlie Day's uh, the impressions that he did of Al Pacino Serpico weren't in the Serpico movie, like some of it, not, not all of it, but and I was kind of... Uh, I kind of I think I lost the star for that reason, but it's still a good movie. A cl it is a classic, you know, 70s movie. Al Pacino, really gritty. He made this after the Godfather one movie, which uh, you know I read a review that this movie Serpico made him stay a star as the Godfather uh, started out his career and uh, solidified him as an actor. Not much else to say about Serpico. It is a classic. If you like Al Pacino, you'll definitely love it if you've never seen it. I am glad I saw it. Uh, not as good as I thought it would be, but it's still a solid three and a half to four stars movie if you're going to give it four stars. Like I said, I just gave it three and a half because of the Charlie, the Charlie Kelly thing from It's Always Sunny. I really thought some of the scenes that Charlie Kelly did in that episode were going to be in Serpico, but I was wrong about that. But that's all right. It was still a great movie. Go see it, Al Pacino. Rent it, whatever. And movies are my life, and I love movies. Thank you, guys.